Right. Everything my level's okay. Rockon should uh, know this. And yeah. So we are going with the. Uh, I actually didn't even look. We're gonna be going with the. Uh, what is this? No, no mod. Can't tell. Oh, I wasn't even looking. So man manual Markram and D ranks on you as the bracket resets. Very interesting. I need to pull up the sheet. Just haven't looked at the sheet yet. Okay, so we're going to be going with Nomad 4. Comment for the, what's the comment for this? A stolen custom one. So we're gonna have Excurito and Lapin in, and the Mini and Zepe. It's gonna wait for Lapin to catch up. Yep. Zepe and Lapin finding some misses here. Amasetic uh, and Ekkurita are holding their combos right now. Amasetic uh, finding a break earlier there. Ekkurita is still holding combo, 94% there. I'm ascetic with a break, but still hold 94. I'm ascetic breaking. Exterior has not given up on that combo. Zepe right now is also holding his combo now. Although only with 90% neck. Exterior is still holding a fantastic combo. Gonna reach a thousand combo soon, yeah. Zepe breaking. Lapin now holding 500 combo. If Kirito is, seems like the speed player. And Setek and Lapin also breaking again there. If Kirito is just going away with us right now. 96% act. I believe a full combo? I'm not 100% sure. Halfway we point of the map. Not the greatest place to be breaking right now for Amacetic and Zepe. The Kyoto is still 1600 combo now. Lapin, Amacetic, and Zepe are building their combos up now, but Excurito right now is just taking it away. 500,000 score, 97% act. He's gotten into the zone now. Here's our second commentator. Hello. I believe you are the second commentator. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> So, we have a nutty player right now, Excurito, who has 2,100 combo. <laughs> um, so, I can't miss the stop. Yeah. You're just gonna have to have both uh, things yeah, open so you can hear sound. Yeah. Mm, fairly one sided, uh, Excurito just holding 2,000 combo on that map. One miss also. 95% ack. Giving him 750,000 score. Compared to everyone else who had sub uh, 300,000, sub 400,000 score. So yeah. Also, with only one miss, 
which is uh, quite cracked considering that everyone has it. Well, yeah. The second best is a 10 miscount. Yeah, I believe that was a speed map and Executor is a speed player, if I'm correct. Uh, yeah. from, what, from what I've seen him play in this uh, tournament. But anyway... See what we're gonna be going for mods. Which mod are we gonna be going with? I haven't. I actually haven't listened to any of these maps. Um, because I actually haven't even looked at the map pool. <laughs> um, I don't know where you're going hidden. Ooh, hidden. I recognize one of the maps from hidden. And we get hidden one, which I actually was going to say I wanted. <laughs> no, that, that's hidden four. <laughs> oh, wait, is that hidden four? Oh, okay, yeah, hidden four. I was looking in the wrong row. <laughs> I was hoping for, I was hoping for hidden one. So what do you know about this map is that it's uh, high AR fairly nine point seven. Hmm. While well, being a bit low on the OD side, during the AR being eight point seven. Yeah, OD the OD uh, is fairly low for an HD map. Should make it a little bit easier for to act it, but. Uh, I can imagine this map is uh, HD4. That would be a Ultra Tech. Usually the gimmick is HD5. But yeah, uh, I haven't looked at these maps, so I wouldn't really know. Sounds like you've looked at them though. Yep. We have some uh, players swapping out here. Kirito is swapping out. Oh wait, he's come back in. There we go, there's the good lucks. Slowly jumping into the map. Yep. It's a slider intensive map, it seems. That's skipping. Uh, I forgot how to pronounce that. Uh, mapper is mapper. Mapper is. Uh. But yeah. Kitching. Okay. <laughs> yeah. But still, um, their maps are uh, usually very uh, like wide angle. Hmm. Oh, well, as we can see, also it's quite slightly heavy. We have Amazadic break being the first break. Oh, never mind, that should be the second one after that. Mm. So, being the first one to break on the PI. Executor and Nope. Nope are still holding their combos strong. With the. Uh, I can't tell who has more act actually. Increase I'm not finding another break. Yeah. I'm like slowly recovering from that. Oh, never mind. Never mind that. Yeah, we have two FCs so far, and uh, the other two players are a bit struggling on this map. Yeah, right now it's an act lead for Emmanuel Markram at this point. Reaching the halfway point of the map now. And Mesetic is breaking. A great place to be breaking right now. Because uh, while we see the players breaking a lot, the, the score difference will not be huge until one day the break. Yes. Yeah, trading close. We used to keep trading close, but 
But we still need a good support and score from MSA Tech or Eleven. Yep. So that's providing that score difference right now. Oh, here is a breaking. Yeah. Nope. Nope, being the only seal And we're gonna see the score go into favor of D ranks you now. Slow game. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. As well. yeah. Missing on the screen part as well. Yeah, multiple breaks from Nope there, dropping his accuracy and score quite a bit there, giving uh, Emmanuel Markram the score advantage now. Definitely breaking again. Yeah, people are losing this you now. Because, well, you, you, you yeah. can definitely feel that this map is very heavy. Yeah, very, very old heavy. Yeah. There's a flow aim quite a bit. Change in spacing and all. Yeah, you miss a stream and uh, you not only just lose on the future score, you lose this score, you kind of have so it's, uh, mm. You can go very fast, very fast. This is true. And with a sm fairly small score difference, we have Emmanuel Mark from taking the second point, and also, I believe. Um, that's also a breakpoint, I believe. Yeah, that's a breakpoint for Emmanuel Markram. If I think uh, if Nope didn't uh, just miss in that one little section there, I think he gained like around about like eight plus misses and a bunch of hundreds and stuff. I think if he didn't miss there, it would have been a far closer game. Yeah, the, the strength part definitely ruined it all for them because you can even see the HP crowd going mm. right down. Yeah, and Excurator made it through that uh, stream part also, funnily enough. I think he just uh, randomly uh, broke in like different parts of the map with misses. Yeah. Mm. See what we're going to be going with now for mod picks. No mod. No ice. We have already played one down. It's... And we have some nice bank. Is not one one. How come? <laughs> no, no, no mod one was like the good old days when we were uh, farming and learning how to get good at Osu. No mod five yeah. it is. Like no mod five. I was hoping for no mod two, to be honest. Good old Dragon Force. Yeah, Bands. It's also Silence player being quite difficult to come up around. Well, well, we aren't being left out on anything good uh, because we have Kitty G's turn coming up. Oh, yeah. You can expect uh, some uh, wacky mapping, if I'm correct. Yeah, as, as well as SHK, which is uh, quite a comfortable artist for Kitty G's turn to go ham. Mm hmm. CS5, AR8, OD8, so it's weird, H HP5, CS5, AR8, OD8, nice. Yeah, it's quite high star rate, mm. if you think about it that way, it's like a AR8 and it's 5.7 stars, I mean almost 5.8. Back. Yeah, and also with the OD being fairly low and still being the high stars, actually, if you think what the hell is in this map. Yeah, slowly jumping into the map. Yeah. Fairly short map also, 2 minutes 18 seconds. Arm length. Yeah, this is this is going to be. I mean, no, it's not going to be. I was about to say that it's going to be who misses first that they lose, but it's Kitty Chaser. It's just going to be a pure hell. But I believe. Yeah. Uh, I can see that some players um, currently playing that like. I put my eyes on two. The, they can do some nasty stuff on Kitty Chaser maps. Yeah, that is true. And also without the HD, you're not going to have much trouble with uh, reading, if I can say that. So... Oh yeah, this is uh, Finger Control Central. 
know, yeah, yeah. the map kind of is straightforward, but it it definitely it it may look easier, <laughs> but trust me, it's so not. Yep. 2010 mapping in 20 uh, when was this map released? 2020. Yeah. So 2020 sure. mapping, but uh, yeah, 2020. Yeah. Yeah, this is uh, not even sure if it's uh, just being control heavy. I'm having trouble telling what's going on, so it's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Everyone, everyone except Markram uh, finding a miss there. Yeah, holy damn. Halfway point of the map now, Markram is just gunning it with combo. Yeah, also being the only carry for the entire uh, map. Oh, never mind, it breaks, but still, <laughs> the score difference is already kind of big. It's really yep. only halfway through the map. Also, looking at the uh, accuracy, well, I had trouble because uh, it's kind of look wonky, but. Yeah, 94% for Kirito and Markram is 95, I believe. Then Amacetic is actually struggling a lot. 70 70% act, basically. 77. Yeah, they're, they're in node lock hell. Yeah. Yeah, Markham missing again. Excurito almost recovering into the big combo boys, but yeah, dropping back in. And Mesetic oh. is really struggling. Yeah, it's it, pulling their their score quite a bit. You can't. There is a, there is a huge like snapping rush. Yeah. You can see because uh, when you look at the press, it's just slow, but kind of hits it. Well, Markham also finding. Uh, no, a way to not log it through the entire section of the map. Yeah, but... I'm also forgetting the spin, but... but <laughs> 300,000 yeah. score difference. Uh, I believe that was thanks... Oh, yeah, so Excurita and Markram actually both uh, did fairly well. Amacetic could really struggle in that map, pulled down the team score quite a bit there. Also, yeah, uh, Excurita actually being the highest highest score, although we, we kind of expect Markram to be that, because, well, First, look at uh, whoever gets the first combo. But yeah, Excurita was carrying through the last section of the map, well, uh, second half of the map, in fact. Mm. Markham being the one to carry through the first. No, no, having a quite good score as well. If you, but both, both of them had the same combo, also. Yeah, it's just uh, I think Markham at the end there just uh, like no no lock hull, as you said. So there's yeah, not much you could no, do there. Yeah, I mean, like probably. Just having a, a bad time reading the date. Yeah. What are we going? Ah, uh, Amacetic, uh, not looking happy there. <laughs> Can't read the bottom message there. Actually, let me just go onto the stream, then I can read the chat. Okay. Oh, there we go. Are you kidding me? Wow. That's what it says. <laughs> I mean, honestly, uh, oh, going in short, but honestly, <laughs> not sure if they uh, side read that. I doubt they side read that because side reading is uh, such maps is uh, is hell. But if they have, I would, I would have probably had the exact, the exact same reaction. <laughs> um, you'd be uh, although I suppose it is grand final, so they would have practiced. But like, you'll be surprised with some what some players can do if they don't if they just side read the AR8 because some of them are ridiculously easy. And we have uh, infinite of nuclear fusion. Uh, that's a loosen up. That's a, that's a real good one too. One of the mm. best ones, I believe. Also, I believe it's also an old map. No, never mind. It's not. It's not. The, yeah, another one. yeah, yeah. I know which one you're confusing with, with because I also played that map a while ago. Like when I when I first started OC, also I played that map. Yeah, an interesting Literally. comment being uh, just Doho. Yep. Looking at the leaderboard also, the highest combo, or the lowest combo on the leaderboard is 400. And there's not a single HRFC from what I can see, except the HD HR. Yeah, and also there are only 20 supports with uh, combo higher than 1000, so yep. it's definitely going to be a struggle watch, I believe. That's the truth. But he's... I know Excurito is a D-ranker. He D-ranked from three digits. 
play in the, to play in this tournament and some other tournaments, if I'm correct. Um, well, I, 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 I did see Excurito deranking real hard to play in Cold. They were deranking so much, it's insane. <laughs> they got from 3 digits to 5k in like, a few weeks. Yeah, I believe oh, I, I believe Excurito was um, like literally the the Osu staff said to us uh, basically when we did screening. They're like, "Oh yeah, watch out for Excurito." <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that is so broken. But yeah. Yeah. Uh, now into the map. So far, looking kind of simple. What is this? comes to consistency. Yeah. Doubles. Small, small circle size can throw people off, but if you are like at this late stage of the game, you should be able to aim easily. Yeah, I'm looking confident so far, with the uh, Zeppe being the highest uh, accuracy. Yep. Yeah, the way I can see it, it's. Uh... Probably going to be stamina heavy because you can see oh, yeah, oh they keep breaking there. Also, these space streams are a bit orangey. Yeah, it's like they come, they do come out of nowhere, and you just have to hope for the best. Well, you can hear them, but you don't really expect them, and uh, the spacing is really weird and how they enter the space stream as well. Mm. Uh, anyway, um, Zeppi being the only combo break so far in this map. Yeah, I can't tell. Let me look at the stream quickly so I can see the axe. So 98% for Excurito, 98% for Lappin, 97 for Nope, and 97 for Zepe. Yeah, so... We can go this so far. Mm. They would have been on the leaderboard already. Oh, Ooh, Excurito! Excurito yeah, right now Nope, he just has to hold his combo. Yeah, Zepe breaking. Unlucky me as well. Yeah. Also losing some accuracy uh, on the card burst section. Yeah. Lappin is still holding a, a strong 98%. Oh, Lappin broke as well. Oh, on the, sli on the slider stream. Oh, yeah, he did. Yeah, I was about to comment that uh, it's uh, quite an unlucky part to break on, but then yeah. it just breaks. <laughs> and now it's free combo at this point. Yep, nope. About to take that advantage. Yeah. Because also the way HR works on Scorpio 2, it uh, busts the score a lot if you have high accuracy at the very end of the map. So yeah, you get that. Well, it may the seem they're still close right now. It's uh, going to change very soon. Yeah, it just doesn't break. Yeah, Zepe also has to still provide a good supporting score because right now Emmanuel Marker and both of them have over 500,000. Left and breaking. Yeah, breaking gun. As, uh, as I was saying, you can see that the advantage just jumped out. Yeah. Yeah, it's good to slowly keep recovering, but it's not going to be enough, I'm afraid. Yeah, are we going to see an FC yeah. from Nope? Lappin and ZK breaking. Yep, that's the first HRFC on the map as well. Yep. Well, we don't know, because uh, in my mind, uh, they all can probably FC it. It's just that they don't set out to FC it, you uh, know? It's true, but it's the first one we see. <laughs> yeah. 97% FC, very good. Lappin with unfortunate uh, 98, two misses. Yeah, and uh, that's a 400 PP in this core play, actually. <laughs> Just checked. How, how much? 400 in the 10. Jesus. Yeah, just farming in the match. Yeah, easy. Let me, let me quickly check uh, Nope's. What rank is he? 2100. Um, that's, bro, still, bro. that's still some run game, I believe. Yeah, it would have been like in his like, top. Like, uh, it would have been like somewhere in between like his 60 to 80th um, top PP player. Ah, oh, rankers, man. Mm, well, he's two th rank 2000, so I don't know. You probably could do, do better. I suppose, but yeah, the rankers. Well, we're taking a bit of time to think this through because, well, did they, they, they take the point? 
I mean, yeah. oh, it's uh, manual picking, but yeah. Yeah, it's not a breakpoint yet. Gonna have to hope that yeah. D ranks on you breaks. Uh, oh, breaks us. Oh, uh, we become a DT. Yeah. What DTs do we have even left? DD2, DD3, and DD5. Yeah. Ah, yes, the best map ever. <laughs> Love Sulfage, Vanity Clock. Yeah, AR9. AR9 DT map. Oh, what's that? Yeah, that's a banger. Yeah. Imagine if they put on the Love's one, top of DT. <laughs> Broken. Mm. Funny, the map only goes up to 5.92. Yeah, 5.9 uh, stars. It's even with the DT. Yeah, I refuse to believe it's that easy. Uh, considering it's also quite low ER on the DT side. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, something is going to be wrong in that map, but originally, since we haven't checked the ma maps themselves, we can't really tell for now. Yeah, I imagine it just being quite a bit of jumps. I refuse to believe that. <laughs> I just think it's going to be very, very broken and just dense as hell. Yeah. I could just open up OC right now and quickly run it through the editor. <laughs> no, no. I actually think I played the map uh, two weeks ago. I did look at the the map pool sheet and I quickly downloaded this map. And then that I was it. I definitely played it, but I'm not sure if I played the, this difficulty. Mm. It was on OBS, but whatever, not about us. But slowly, well not slowly, actually we already miss everything and so sharing good locks and have fun. Yep. And getting to the map. There's some... There's some uh, leaderboard players with half time on it. <laughs> Wonder why. Seems pretty tame. <laughs> I don't like this build up. <laughs> <laughs> Scares you. <laughs> if a map begins too easily, well, well, if it begins too easy, there is something wrong about this. Yeah. Wowie has a DT player yep. on this. And that's perfect stack. Perfect stacks and uh, quite dense as well. Mm. And uh, no surprise, everyone is breaking so far. Nope, uh, being the highest combo. Yeah. So far. And Markham holding the highest accuracy, I believe. A Mesetic also breaking. Yeah. Yep, uh, and we have reset, combo reset. Yep. <laughs> Quite a bit of finger control and also reading. I can also... Yeah. I wonder if there's going to be some jumps at the end. Honestly, I'm, I'm not sure because... I think yeah. it already reached the target star rate. Yeah, it's mapping. 20k score difference right now, still plus. And we're gonna be heading into the, like almost the last oh, quarter yeah, of the map already. Yeah, combo resets on the blue team, and uh, it's good as well. Markham recovering. Yeah. Breaks. I'm aesthetic breaking. Gonna head into like the last section of this map, which is always hell. Executor breaking. Yeah. Having combo breaks everywhere again. Yeah. And you can kind of see why. This is hella broken. Yeah. Note breaking. Markham is just holding at this point. The last yeah, section of the map. Never mind. And, but yeah, still, never mind. The fact that uh, all of them are even holding over the current K is already insane. Yeah. Yeah, that's in finals for you. These parents are getting even more awkward now. 
Yeah, Markram finding quite a bit of misses with note locks, I believe. Can't tell right now. Okay, everyone's breaking. Yep. And uh, we have Emmanuel Markroom taking this point. Yeah. It was their was their pick. Yep. And Ryzen, you need to slowly start picking. Well, not that we you, they can actually pick him out, but they, they need uh, something yeah. they can really own on. Because uh, this is looking good for them. Yeah, I think they link. I think they're um, they've lost two map of their maps, right? If I'm correct. Hopefully. See what we're gonna go into now. Seems like the players are avoiding HD. It seems, with only one of the maps been have been played. Okay, I just checked. Looks like they only lost one. I mean, yeah, uh, Emmanuel Markham has one breakpoint. Ah, uh, okay. And the rest is their picks. Yeah, yeah. Have to make a smart decision here on what mod to pick now. Going with uh, DT. Is that DT? Yeah, DT again. Yeah, going DT again. I think because uh, they just know it's, it's a 50 50. Or, well, because they're confident enough in both DT2 and DT3. Yeah, and, although. Uh, this isn't the speed one, no. DT2 is the speed. Oh, that's actually a pick map. Oh, this. Mm -hmm. AR10. Yeah. It's the second highest AR for the DT map pool, funnily enough. All other three maps are below AR10. Yeah, interesting enough. We don't we even have a 10.3, it's just straight up 10.5. Yeah, and that one was banned. Yeah. Frankie DD, it can't be bad. Yeah, it can't be bad, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, the map seems fun. Honestly, that, it feels kind of much first, faster than. Oh, it's a 10.2. Yeah. Never mind, it's in light, it's 10.2 ER. Ah, uh, yeah, the thing's probably not calculating properly. Yep. That's all, I think, I don't know what stream uh, we get in stream at, like uh, if it's 30 FPS, that can also make it uh, look super fast. Yeah, anyway, we have a magnetic uh, carrying so far. Yeah, if here's are breaking also. Yeah, I think also, like, they're taking their revenge, at least for now, because uh, they've have been uh, a having a breaking. struggle. Exterior breaking, yeah. everyone breaking now. Basically, a combo reset. I must have still have made some good room for breathing. Hmm. Yeah, the, the, everyone's struggling for a very good reason. Finger control central. Oh, is that been breaking? Yeah. Lapping now. Lap on the, oh, never, never mind. mind. Combo reset. So it's about a 110k score difference. Oh, yeah. So there's a lot of time still to catch up halfway, over, uh, halfway through the map. Yeah, it's slowly recovering with combo. So, you never know what happens. Yeah, it seems like this is the free combo section here. Oh, except for breaking, and Latin also breaking. Excurator has to hold here. Yeah, I'm a breaking. 
Is there a beam the only combo now? Oh. Alright. Uh, yeah. It's security breaks. See, I think, uh, what's the, the act difference? Uh, there's a massive act difference also. Xterita struggling with Aqua's and also lapping a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure if you got the, the accuracy advantage in the very beginning of the map. Yeah, so but they pay with 96% Ak. Yeah, Xterita's Ak is really pulled down his score, I think. Uh, yep. uh, definitely feeling much more confident on this map for um, ranks on you, I mean. Mm. Um, I'm just like also kind of making a good room to breathe in at the very beginning of the map, which uh, results in having even bigger score difference. Yes. Uh, well, we can also see that they're much more comfortable on this AR. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. this apparently this map had was originally AR 8.5. I'm reading like the Twitch chat. Huh. I thought this was still the easiest DT by far even after we buffed the AR, but it seems not. <laughs> this is the one map tester. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely by no means uh, an easy map. Yeah. I mean, the Branks and you taking their point confidently. Uh, the manual Markham now peaking. Mm. See what uh, they're gonna be going with because now they have a guaranteed DT pick. Yeah, although it may seem like uh, we have a lot of massive playthrough, it's uh, not exactly a huge list left. Hmm. I, I know a lot of players also complained about uh, DT2, if I'm correct. Mm -hmm. But I'm not sure if they're gonna pick it or not. Well, it is speedy, is all I can say. Yeah. Lots of HD still to work with. I don't know why, uh, why they, maybe they're leaving it for lost, the teams. We also have uh, HR2 and HR1. Still. Yeah. yeah. It seems like Emmanuel and Markram has been working with no more than the, the DTs for their wins. They're not rushing their pace, that's for sure. Yeah, they have two minutes. Two minutes of wasting our time. <laughs> I'm just joking. And DT. DT again. Yeah. Interesting. Three times DT. So here's a speed map. I'm gonna assume that uh, Executor is gonna be in here because he played the speed map uh, on no mod and did fairly well on it. I'm not sure if they will actually swap out any players because uh, mm. I find that it felt like uh, they were they were the most comfortable on DT last time. Yeah, uh, so that may I mean that's a small struggle, but still, it's running their teammates real good. Yeah, I know. And Lappin also being mm. the higher players, Markham not so. I, I believe Markham is the HD player, uh, but like they're more of a gimmick player. I would say. Really? But not, not a really high DPM player, I mean, for this mm. reason, because uh, most of their scores, notable ones, are made on low BPM maps. Yeah, yeah. See how this will go. This is bracket reset, yeah, this is bracket reset. So I actually wonder what uh, the, score, the scores was for the previous maps. I have no, no cave build up, at least for now. Um, yeah. But I assume since people complain about it a lot, I would assume it has uh, really broken burst or something. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm aesthetic and executor nailing those uh, bursts. It's quite good at first to do because I that this is uh, 270 BPM. Yep. Also, ODA. But I believe that's before applying DT. Mm -hmm. it, I, I feel like the low OD is um, yeah, like a characteristic. Is worse. Yeah, it's a uh, it's also characteristic of uh, old maps. I feel. Oh, I don't know, but 
Yeah, having low OD means a lot of health loss, so no room to make a mistake here. Yeah, that is true. Executor is nailing that round half of combo. Also, he has the highest act, I believe. Oh, Lappin, yeah. well, ooh. breaking there, unfortunately. Yeah. Lappin is uh, not having a great time with the, the act right now. Pulling his score a little bit down from everyone else's. I mean, yeah, this map is a very, very easy to lose accuracy on. Yeah. You just have to not pluck through an entire stream and you lose way too much. Or you just overstream and then you just have all those hundreds sitting on you now. Yeah. They're gonna, they're gonna be seeing each other's scores right now, so hopefully no nerve setting. Mm -hmm. Ah, excuse me, everyone breaking. And the combo reset now. Yeah. But the death stream, yeah, these streams are quite very, quite hard. Yeah. Last quarter of the map now. About a 90,000 score difference. Also having the Ack lead, I believe. Hmm. So unless the... Uh, oh, well, right. unless the Xkirio screws up real bad, it's... Uh, it's, not, it's not going to be an easy... Point yeah, Zepe right there also hitting a bunch of hundreds on that last that last bit of stream. And Emmanuel Martin taking their fifth point. Yeah. Need two more wins from them, and D ranks on you needs to get uh, two break points, I think, if I'm correct, to be able to uh, match Emmanuel Markram. And then head into tiebreaker. No, actually, they only need one. One. Yeah. Let's see, they, they need points. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, it's they picked right now. Yeah. Sorry. Plus, Dermot Klein having a struggle. Yeah. Have to wait uh, for Rock on. There we go. A uh, little streamer. The main complaints on that map is uh, the sliders and the ending square jump pattern. HR, we're going HR now. Ooh. HR3. HR3. Usao. I don't know actually how you say that. Um, yeah. Um, okay, uh, translate.duple.com. Yeah. Siaga. Siaga. Could be like some. Oh uh, yeah, Siaga. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Well, Guar uh, guarantee tech map, Usao. Always. Yeah, going to be a no slider aim, but uh, very heavy on on thing control. Hmm. I think that's what usually you Usao maps are. Yeah, that is true. So, I'm looking at the previous uh, match that they had, and apparently, uh, let's see, D ranks when you won this map the last time. Oh, interesting. So, so yeah, there is confidence. Good. Yeah, but uh, it was a fairly close one. It was about 40. 60k score difference, so it was a close game. Hmm. Latin finding the first miss. Oh my, actually, there is uh, some slider into it, but. Yeah, it's cute to breaking. Yeah, the map is going real very fast. Yeah, <laughs> slide, uh, slide the spam if I can say. They've been no nope FC so far, and the uh, excluded lap just uh, have break at the break. Hmm, interesting. Wonder. Oh, no, he's not uh, not holding through the boss ladder. Hmm. No. Yeah, it can't be mouse problems. Usually, uh, I find like if you're a mouse player, you struggle a bit with those uh, sliders, if I can say. 
I was, I checked them, but here they only have very good accuracy. Oh yeah, that is true. Wonder if this map picks up even more towards the end with these sliders. Zepe oh, is breaking out there. The build up. Yeah. Yeah, a bit of nerves standing in. I mean that the uh, they they held them to quite a good combo with accuracy though. Yeah. But now we have X Guru and Lappin slowly pinning up the combo and as uh well <laughs> sure them break but uh Kurdel is slowly pumping back. <laughs> Although I don't believe there is enough time for them left to actually survive this. So Yeah, with yeah. multiple breaks and all that. Yeah, Excuta also has low act, that's the problem there. He's not gonna get that act boost at the end. Yeah, Drenkin is going to take this point with uh, a lot of confidence actually. Unlike yeah. last time. They basically got better scores than the last time also. Yeah. It, it, quite good scores as well. Yeah, Zepe, 96% act. He did way better than uh, he did last time. He only got uh, 378 combo the last time with 95% act. So he improved quite a bit there. Yeah. Is that 737? Sag. Please don't. Sag. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, Emmanuel well, is going to have to carefully pick now because. Uh, they're about to enter the match point stage of the, of the match. So yeah. they then also have a lot of maps to work with left. They have a they have a lot of HD, but it seems like both teams are avoiding HD. But uh, they have the guaranteed HR and this uh, some RNG no mods. Yeah, this could also mean not just avoiding but uh, holding it. Back for yeah. these uh, in the case they actually need no more three. No more three. That Japanese title song, yeah. I'm not <laughs> pronouncing that. <laughs> Fuck you. You know what I usually do, because I stream and commentate at the same time, I usually plug it into Google Translate. And then like I'll be like, oh this song and then I'll just quickly play the Google Translate over it. <laughs> He ranks on you won this pick last match. It also looks like we aren't going to see any team changes in that Yeah. And, uh, is this the fourth or fifth map we have the same line? Um, I don't know. Actually, it's because, like I feel like the players will swap out if it goes to HD. That's the thing. Huh. Yeah, it looks like if uh, Ranksen you wins this one, they're, they're gonna have to go for Hidden. Yeah, this is the old map, yes it is, yeah. Quite an awkward one, it's not easy. Mm. That makes sense, because um, we've seen already at least two other alt maps that have been purely low. So yeah. that's uh, quite a lot of balance. Yeah, it's nice to see some snap aim in old maps. A lot of speed aim is uh, disregarded a lot of times. Yep. But still, uh, we can see that we have uh, two FCs on the board so far on each team. I mean, uh, one FC on each team. And yeah. uh, also early breaks for, uh, for the other couple. Yeah, Excuser is pulling the score tiny bit down with his accuracy. Hence, uh, D ranks on you having the score lead. Because both players have 98, 97%. Dappin still holding a nice high act, but with an FC. Excuser, ooh. Breaking there. Yeah, over him a lot. Yeah. Yeah, we also have a Mazetic uh, having a combo reset, and uh, together we have. One FC for each team going in so far. Yeah. As for the accuracy, I believe Blatten has the accuracy advantage so far. 
Yeah, halfway point of the map now, you can't break at this point, I believe. Otherwise your score is just gonna be screwed. Yeah, it could though. Well, I was about to say they were coming in to support their teammate, but... Yeah. So, I'm gonna he's gonna have to... Yeah, he's really he's struggling really with that. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah, so, yeah course, we, we can see that the discord of is actually quite big. Uh, despite, we, despite having two C. Yeah. If C unleashed him again, I could say two C for whatever reason. Yeah, yeah Amacetic and Ikuto, their score difference is 100,000, so that's an extra 100,000 score for uh, D ranks and you. Yeah, I was really good. Being a huge support right now. Yeah. And we have Nurse and me now, now that we have seen Raid. Yeah. No, no pass to hold these combat. Oh, oh nothing breaks. Nothing breaking. Ow. Uh, no, nobody's uh, going to uh, just to see this through. Yeah. Nobody's going to see it. I was going to say, like, no pass to break for Emmanuel Malcolm to even think nope. of uh, catching up. See, yeah. the second map the match, actually. They're just farming. Yeah, 98% ac. What is that? What, what star is this map? That, um... Well, to be honest, you don't That's even That's a 384 BP <laughs> play, so congratulations to Nope uh, successfully farming two maps so far. Uh, uh, you can't farm alt maps, that's the thing. Alt maps don't give PP. <laughs> well, too bad, they just they just farmed it. <laughs> but yeah, the ranks of you are taking the breakpoint. Mm. So they can they can recover now. Now that head is their big, so. Yeah, with the... Uh, well, I hate it when the client does this, to be honest. But, um... Was it, what was I going to say? <laughs> so, players, uh, teams are still avoiding HD. We're gonna see if we're gonna be going with HR or no mod now. Honestly, the short one's going to be quite RNG considering that it's uh, an aim map. So I don't, I believe they're just avoiding everything that they can mm. aim because, I mean, uh, Regular aim because the, that's just going to be a coin flip. So yeah, yeah. I hope we will see that until they have they even the points out. Yeah, and we're going to be going with HD actually. Hidden H more. HD. Oh, never mind. That's hidden H five. Oh uh, yeah, hidden five. I was going to say HD two for some reason. Keep on looking uh, at the wrong row. <laughs> Okay, there is the map. Stolen custom too. <laughs> a flask map, so also low BPM and uh, really enough on high SR, so prepare for a lot of weird stuff. Yeah, um, Emmanuel Markram is just swapped out for Markram now. As I, I, my hypothesis was correct that Markram is the HD player, it seems. <laughs> yeah, that's actually an interesting pick from the ranks of you. Mm. I don't think they actually took the last hidden. No, they didn't. So it's actually an, an interesting pick. I wonder what the what's going to turn out to be like because they haven't really showed the amazing performance uh, on hidden so far. Yeah. yeah. Oh, never mind. They took hidden three last time. Yeah, Ma Markram. Markram's good at the. Uh... Like we saw, he was pretty good at uh, reading and uh, what's it, the AR8 also, so it'll be interesting. Is this the AR... wait. It's AR9. It's AR9. Is it oh, AR9? The... No, this is the AR8 map. Oh wait, and I'm dumb. What? I'm so, I'm so dumb, I'm looking at HD2 still. I'm still We're looking still at listening. HD2. HR4, don't mind me. <laughs> yeah, AR9. Yeah. Uh, also, <laughs> OD8.5. I'm going mad, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not Stalin Custom 2, it's Val. It's going comments. to be definitely Wiggle and Space Trains because I can, can see another reason why a 150 ppm map would have a 6.3 stars. Yeah. 
Uh, a lot of snapping. I could have been the first part one, being the first one to break very early. Markman being the second one. Yeah. So, I thought it doesn't um, make too much difference right now, but it will definitely pay out uh, for the blue team. I mean. Mm. Also, the map is quite short, so every miss counts a lot. So actually, I don't mind. Xperia to break it again. So breaking. the score difference is uh, already a hundred k. Yeah, Nope is just uh, going through right now. Ninety-seven. Yeah, ninety-seven percent act on it. Also. Yeah, Nope. Nope woke up recently. I mean, no, it's not. It's just the smash. I mean, so they're just farming it now. Hmm. Yeah, well, Markroom is uh, catching a lot of node locks, and Xcurry has been the, the one to carry the team so far. Yeah, uh, nope, finding his first break. Unfortunate, but uh, they have the huge advantage now. So, unless yeah. they screw up bad, it's already their point. Yeah, the score is sort of catching up, mainly because Amasetic uh, has uh, quite a bit of act drop earlier. Drop from 97 yeah. to 93. Xcurry is uh, carrying it back. Now that I know this, the, the score difference is uh, the gap is close in. Yeah, yeah, they're about to take, oh, they're about to take over. Holy damn, Xcurity is just uh... going through. Markram also good with yeah, the. Yeah, no, Markram good... just recovering the combo. Yeah, oh, like Xcurity on the side is... as well. Now because you can you Markram breaking. to recover the combo. So this is a very close one. Yeah, but Nope is not giving up right now on his combo. The end of the map. Oh god. Yeah. The first one not gonna be enough. Oh, so Markham is gonna take this point and Yeah. Mar Emmanuel Markham, Jesus Christ. Who names these things? But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Emmanuel Markham uh, entering the match point stage. They just yeah, need that... one point left to win this. Yeah, that was another break point though. And now they pick also. So now they have, I believe they have three Nomads, some HDs to work with, and yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, this is also a manual mark from Speak, so Draxon needs to basically just go and win the tiebreaker if they want this match. Mm. They're in a very tight spot now. It was, it was, yeah, it was a tiebreaker previous match. Let's see here. What are these? Uh, these are just the... Uh... Oh, it really was. Interesting. Mm. So we're gonna be going and, uh, number two. <laughs> yeah. So it can be a really good map to f finish off on. Also, good old Dragon Force. Sounds player though. So it's uh, you <laughs> either get a very good score on it or a very bad score. You yeah. can't have the middle. Or well, it's... actually, you can have a middle if you just shit me somewhere. Mm hmm. Let's see. Uh, so the previous match um, seems like Executor and Lappin took this map by almost a hundred thousand points. Wow, well, do you think they're uh, they were really keeping this normal then? Just for this, so what? I mean, they also had yeah. to roll a bit because uh, Nomad One was never played. Yeah, Nomad One. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Executor and Lappin also won Nomad One, but it was very close, also by like 10k score difference. Yeah, that enough. was a, that was quite a conflict actually. Hmm. But uh, the blue team has to really hope the uh, they get they get either very lucky or yeah, or not gonna... lucky enough. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna turn the song up. Banger song. Well, early breaks, but the map is uh, fairly long and also a lot of compass, so it won't matter too much. Mm -hmm. As long as you can keep your act towards the end or just don't um, overstream or understream, you should be fine. Or even both lock. I'm ascetic already, really breaking. Oh, nothing following that. I could also. So Zeppel, despite being the first one to break, is now the highest combo. Yep. Well, the map is actually very high combo, I believe, uh, considering it's uh, some players so that they somehow ma managed to throw in 3k combo in 2 3 minutes. So. <laughs>
Yeah, the map is 1.6, 1.7k almost combo, so... Hmm, yeah, like the pre previous match, Xyrus and Zepe also had very high act on this map. Yeah, there, there is a lot to hold, a, a lot of nerves to control. Yeah. I could be recovering. Otherwise, you could go into this fairly confidently, like, thinking to yourself, like, I did really well, but that also can be the downfall of you, being too confident. Also, everyone learned the, um, the first card, the card screen of the map would be the, the, the weird space one. Yeah. But also, we have uh, breaks across the board now. I'm the, the only one holding couple that. Yeah. I feel like uh, it must have been like note lock of some kind for some of the players to have lower arc. In the reality, it's uh, kind of high, so it's hard to note lock. Mm. Oh, is uh, Zeppi breaking? Oh, well, Lapin yeah. is going to be uh, their opponent. Yeah, Zeppi and Executor are holding their, both of their 98% axe also. Last quarter of the map now. Well, I'm as a breaking. This can go very wrong now. It could have uh, now been the leading bubble, which means they will take the lead now. So, unless it's good it breaks, it's uh, the end. Yeah, he needs to either hit a bunch of hundreds on the slot on the. I can't speak today. <laughs> on yeah, the streams. The, the, the score difference is now very big, actually. I mean, very big for, for how oh, much oh. left left. Oh god. Uh, oh god. Yo, yo, excuse oh, me. <laughs> Emmanuel Markram winning the tournament. Yeah. Also winning the bracket reset. Congratulations to well, both teams and congratulations to Emmanuel Markram for winning the tournament. Yeah, and, D uh, ranks on, on you, I believe, was the ones that also sent Emmanuel Markram to losers bracket. So they basically made a major comeback there. That was one that hell of a tournament. Insane. GG. <laughs> Both matches were very close. Yeah. First one going to tiebreaker and the second one ending at seven, at seven to four. Hmm. But also having a very close scores on, um, well, a lot of maps. <laughs> yeah. Just to be sure. Yeah, like uh, it, it was very close because uh, Emmanuel, I think Excuser, like he dropped quite a bit of act there right at the end there, so. If he didn't hit those like last few notes, I believe he hit them. But like if he didn't hit those, I think uh, D ranks and you might have won that. With a drop decent act low enough for that. Uh, yeah, th that could happen. Yeah, that happened. That was very close. Every, yeah, every mistake, like uh, the small mistake they made, uh, just threw normal two uh, like another way around instantly. Yeah. The other. Yeah. I think uh, that's the end. I don't know when Rockon will end this live stream. But yeah, thank you guys all for watching the tournament. 36 viewers, or 32 video viewers right now on Twitch. Huge. Yeah, but thank yeah. you for coming around. Yeah, thank, thanks to all the staff and all of that also for uh, refing and all of that streaming, etc, etc. But yeah. That's the end of the tournament. Congrats to Emmanuel Malcolm and uh, D ranks in the second place. Yeah. Cheers, guys. See ya.